Yeah. And we had some subscribers. Hello, usually everyone. Still Welcome comments. to a Foreigner Farming in the Philippines. Go ahead. Go ahead. I'm just talking in the background here. Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing is ever scripted on these videos, so you just, uh, I'll just uh, be a fly on wait, the wall you, here. Wait, you didn't get the script? No. I, <laughs> you guys didn't pass it out. You should have been on time. You I got the yeah. script. I, the script ends in about 30 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> everything's, everything's scripted. Lester and Chad got married this morning. Yay! We have Yay. And I was uh, yeah. uh, disposed, let's put it that way. Conspicuous and, by your absence. Yes, and uh, extenuating uh, circumstances, and I missed it. We and missed I, you. And I, and I apologize, guys, but uh, you, and that's not really something you want to say. I'll catch you next time on it. Just uh, it's kind of a one-shot <laughs> deal. Actually, the mayor, the mayor said, said yeah, hope to see you again. A, see you again. Oh man! Oh, that's a that's like a. That's like a, a jab there. <laughs> well, I'm I'm sorry we missed it. I, I really would have liked to have been there, but uh, I explained the reasons why, which I'm not going to share with everyone. <laughs> uh, but uh, I'd like to wish Lester and Chad a congratulations. Thank and, you. Uh, Thank you. They, I, I fired the camera because they were doing they were doing fingersies with their rings and stuff. And it, it was now we're uh, just real icky. Uh, yeah, it's kind of it's kind of icky. Yeah, yeah people, it's just, oh, look at those people. They're always so lovey dovey. Sickening, man. Yeah, sickening. <laughs> so anyway, I I wish you guys congratulations and uh, everyone else chime in. Um, we're happy for you guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank so, you. So were you, are you are you going to do a honeymoon or anything like that? I did, did that. Yeah. You already did that. Well, yeah. well, we can see the consequences of the pre-honeymoon. We're not, we're not but talking about quality time. <laughs> we're talking about a honeymoon. We, I, I'm just curious: is you, are you guys going to Tahiti, or you know, any any plans? We're planning on going to a tropical island in the Pacific. <laughs> <laughs> no, we don't have any plans. No, we don't, we don't have any plans. You know, we just wanted to. Uh, make sure that we uh, solemnize our marriage legally because we love each other and for the sake of our child so we wanted to good on you there's no reason not to we're so happy we've been happy the whole time we've been together yeah yeah so so we i wanted, should we wanted to get it we wanted to get it done and of course uh it took a while to get all the paperwork and it took us that's six what months. I found too. Yeah. It took us about three months on the paperwork and I put that on a video and then uh, this subscriber, Steve, he wrote to me and said it didn't happen like that for me. And he arrived he arrived on the tenth of April and I don't know, I think it was by the nineteenth or twentieth of May they were already married. Well, that's a, that's kind of like a rocket time there. I mean, just incredible. And because there's so many things days, to do. Money, money, money. Maybe <laughs> eleven days of that was waiting for the license to be produced. Well, we had to wait for the guy to sign off the banana planting thing, and it was only only one tree. We only had to plant one banana tree, but it has to be signed off at the Barangay Hall, right? <laughs> And the guy that signs the that you planted a banana tree, right. what? And it's what you always hear in the Philippines. He's at a seminar. Boy, these are the seminarinest government officials I've ever seen in my life. They're always on seminar somewhere, and so we had to wait like three weeks until he got back from this seminar. Yeah. And then, of course, he he signed it. Yeah, where'd you he, guys plant this banana tree over there? Okay, he signed right there. Did you do the seminar for married? people about to be married. Yeah. That was pretty straightforward. I mean, that, and that was, we didn't have to wait for that. It was just right. like the next Tuesday or something. Right. But the big holdup was the, the banana tree guy. <laughs> and I guess you guys had to plant 50? Yeah, we planted them on your land, remember? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, see, the, the, requ the requirements have changed. We only had to do they, one. I think they, <coughs> they changed from one place. In the, he was from Negros. That was his 
That was where he had been. Yeah, look. I think it was Negros. Who was from Negros? This guy that I'm... Oh, the guy, this, guy you're talking about. So that I'm talking about, because that, that was like three weeks. I've heard of people uh, doing that, and they also they pay someone, and they... Uh, you Actually, when you arrive in the country, I think the law is you have to be here for 30 days before you're eligible. So they will backdate really? something. Yeah, so... so you know. See, my, my point in how to get married in the Philippines video was to say, don't think that you can come over here to get married and come over here and say, well, what's it going to take? Three, four weeks, I'll be married. How can it take longer than that? Well, it can, because we're trying to get papers. We often find that we go to the office and we sit in the office and then we find out an hour later that the person who can sign that form is not there and he's not here until, like you said, guy's out and he's doing he's, he's, some kind of a forum somewhere. Yeah. And, and that's what that's what can happen everywhere you go. Now, did you notice that the mayor was very good actually today because she checked the spelling of your names? Yes, yes. So, yeah. it, wasn't it spelling that was wrong on ours? Our names were spelt wrong. Beth's name was spelt wrong on the marriage certificate. That was your out right there, man. You could <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, another opportunity <laughs> missed. But that that cost us money, didn't it? Yeah. Didn't it cost us money to, to change the, the spelling? Kids. Yes. Even though. And it, and actually, that wouldn't have been an out for you. You would have been married to someone else that spelled that way, right? Uh, it would have uh, showed in the records that you're married to this uh, other person. <laughs> So are, are you married to Chatmaine or Charmaine? Chatmaine. Chatmaine, Chat okay. She's, I noticed, she I noticed that she said Charmaine, right? She said, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that was funny. No reason to have it changed now. Well, I'm glad you guys are Thank all, you, all official now. Yeah, we're official now. I know Chad's happy. I'm happy too. My parents so, are So are you so happy? How long, how long has it taken you to get all of the paperwork? Six months. No, 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 not. It took six months because we we ha we need to go to Cebu to go to get your. See, Lester, you you you've just gotten married, so you haven't figured this out yet. You'll never be right about another thing in your life. <laughs> yeah. Just check with Chat before you before you start talking. Sorry, honey, you're right. Six months. <laughs> so it took. Well, let's say it took six months. I don't think it actually took uh, six months. That that's how long we took. Because we weren't in a hurry, okay. right? You know, we take our time. But he's talking about how long it took to actually get all the documents. Yeah. That were I don't think it was th three months, but it was definitely more than two, right. two or three months. Yeah. So I was thinking that someone <coughs> in the West will look at how long it would take them. And let's face it, if you're in America, you could go to Vegas and get married on the spot. Right, yeah. 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 Drag two Ten people. minutes. They'll drag two people off. You don't even have to get out of your car. They have drive-through oh, uh, drive uh, It took us too long because we got misinformation. They said, oh, you need a birth certificate. And I said, I don't need my birth certificate. I have a passport. Mm -hmm. That's as good as my birth certificate. And we never requested my birth certificate. And I said, I'm not going to give a birth certificate. I, you well, know, you had to in the end. No. See. He made a special appeal to the mayor, as I right. Yeah. And, and I, I she went, let I, you I slide went on it. And said, and then, or I went to what was it? The civil registry. The lady at the civil registry, where we went to the office, we went to turn in the yeah. paper. She's the one that said, No, oh, you don't need a birth certificate. If you have a passport, it says your birth date right here in the passport, and this mm -hmm. is your official ID. <laughs> Obviously, you're born. You're standing in front of us, right? So, <laughs> <laughs> so we didn't have to come up with that. But because they said that, then that delayed us. Yeah. Kind of, kind of, you know, had to make some contacts, contacts, try to figure out if I can get my birth certificate, how I can get my birth certificate, and things like that. But in the end, it, so we really didn't need that to begin with. So. Technically speaking, it wouldn't have taken more than two or three months. Two or three months? Yeah. So I'm, I'm thinking if people, people who think that they can come here 
and get married in a month. And, and I think that this... If they're prepared to they come with all the documents they need, then maybe they can, right? Before they come, they request the, uh, what's that called? But see, that's the thing about having all the, about having all the documents you need. Because it depends on who you who you speak to, at whichever particular window you go to, on what documents you need, because that person might tell you one thing, well, and you go back the next, and you go yeah. back two or three days later with yeah. whatever that person requested you to get, and, you and the one you talk to said, "Nah, you don't need that. You need this." Yeah. It happens all the time. I mean, our business permits where you think getting married's rough. Wait till you try to get all your business permits in order. We have. We have. <laughs> oh, well, oh, yeah. Well, yeah. Even this the, morning, <laughs> when we're in the mayor's office, and Terrence and Beth have already arrived, unbeknownst to us, they're down, uh, just waiting in the parking lot, and Chad were and I were waiting in the mayor's office in the air conditioning, and I wasn't concerned about uh, them coming or anything like that, but the, the mayor's, uh, the secretary said, if your sponsor doesn't show up, the mayor will not marry you, your witness. And I said, that's ridiculous. I said, there's all kinds of people around here that can witness. Grab one. Uh, yeah. You know, and she says, well, how about this, the Berenger captain that you know, or how about this, uh, the other. I said, seriously, anybody can be a witness. You know, why are, why are you trying to make it more difficult? But She was just wanting somebody that you knew, or that knew you? I think that they would probably say, no, you have to have someone you know. Yeah. Until someone corrected them and said, no, he doesn't need that. Just like what happened. You don't need, he doesn't need his birth certificate. He has a passport, it's fine. Go figure. Well, we, I had to know the birth certificate. What? Like you said, it depends on who is going to be a talk to you. But that's it everywhere. Yeah, they for, really, for every reason. Going to the bank, and they, they, they don't, don't want to be fired. I think that's probably they, it, right? It's hard to get a job yes, here, and yes. you want to keep a job. You don't want to lose so your job. So they don't want to make any so you want to, judgment calls. Yes. Which they right. could be held accountable. That's right. I'll pay it, play it safe. Whether he yes. needs it or not, I'll say he needs it. I covered my butt, right? Yeah. yeah. I can get a job yeah. from that point. Yeah, if you go in Alturas and ask for something that, that the guy doesn't, doesn't understand what you're saying, what he does understand will be to say out of stock, and then you can go around and say, I'm you sure mean this? This is out of stock? Yeah, and then you go around and, and there's an entire shelf, shelf of, it. of it, you know? So, yeah. We all have the same uh, experience. So inquiring minds want to know, guys, is there ever going to be, is there going to be a church uh, ceremony? Or? No. No? So I'll, I'll take that as verbatim, since that came out of chat's mouth that there's not going to yeah. be a church ceremony. Because really, Lester, it doesn't matter what you want. I mean, well, you, you're just being towed around, you, and you're going to nod your head if, if whatever she had wanted. So if chat says uh, no church ceremony. I don't have church any ceremony, say about anything anymore, right? Well, you have say, but the weight that it carries means yeah. actually nothing now. I think you're doing good, actually, because at least you've got the ring on your finger and not... Not through my nose? <laughs> Not yet. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> By the way, I just, the last. The last. They should that last time. Yeah, yeah. One, one more question. Uh, you didn't have a marriage vows day. Can you have your marriage? Uh, your promise to each other? Yeah. I'm never married. You didn't? Well, wait, 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 wait. Yeah, the marriage vows. We have, where you, where you uh, make your vows yeah. to each other. They, the, the mayor didn't do that part of, do you, Lester, take, take chat mail? Yeah, we did that. Yeah, yeah we did that. Personal, personal message to A personal. Oh, you didn't write your own vows. <laughs> right, yeah, we didn't write our own vows. Oh. And oh. Beth, she's, she's trying to play dirty. <laughs> Just one last thing, one last thing, if I can embarrass you before, we, before I stop my video. No. <laughs> yeah, those, those things are kind of complicated. I think they're kind of well thought out, right? Very fast. There's a lot of thinking. Is it? Yeah. It's easy. Hey, no, it's not easy. Let's see. Go ahead, Lester. Lester, you go ahead. I don't want to cry. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, you, you got to look at 
Mr. Bean. Mr. Bean did the in, in one movie called uh, Four Funerals. No, Four Weddings and a Funeral. There's a movie called Four Weddings. Very funny. And uh, Mr. Bean, Rowan Atkinson, does the pastor who does the wedding. And, and he makes all kinds of mistakes. She, the, the, uh, yeah, the, the mayor made a few. <laughs> he called, she called chat Charmaine. <laughs> had a few little things like that where she said, uh, and now, now, Lester, oh no, sorry, um, chat. <laughs> <laughs> and she was reading. Yeah. Right. But she was actually very nice. In defense this is this of this mayor, that she is kind of new, right? I mean, she's yeah. only had this job for yeah, a couple months, actually, right? She was actually very nice, very, very, very Yeah, nice. she's very nice. I thought Very so. warm. Yeah. Very I, warm, I yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. Yeah, it's a different mayor that married. Uh, Marcel and I. Yeah, we went with uh, Duane and Lovely May, and once again, the, we thought that the, the mayor was uh, very dry. But when it was a wedding, he really tried very hard, yeah. didn't he? And he said, "Oh no, come on!" And he, he arranged he arranged all the photographs the same as she did today. Oh no, come on this side, and I go in the middle. And, yeah, and then when they go out, uh, the mayor says. Don't forget me for being a board member because she's running for a board member <laughs> in the next election. She knows you already. Yeah, that mayor before. Ah, uh, before. Ah, uh, that's right. He was about to. Uh, go he for works on the governor's election. board, right? Yeah. He's a government yeah. board member. Yeah. So, did uh, when you looked at your camera after the lady took the picture, you guys were off. But she put this really kind of strange. She put you off to the side. Were you just out of the picture completely? The girl had taken a it's, picture of just it's us? It's dark. Both oh, no, the on picture your was side, dark. Yeah. We, were oh, in, dark. We, we were in the picture because we put the camera that way. But, but when we walked around the side, yeah, we, we didn't, didn't expect to see, <laughs> to see that there was another, an L shaped thing. So we couldn't, yeah, you couldn't, couldn't get behind the desk. You know. I didn't either. She said, I'll meet you guys on this side. And I, <laughs> standing over on the side of the servant. <laughs> over there behind the Aspidestra. <laughs> yeah, you're behind like a vase and so on. Yeah, through the jungle. <laughs> no, I would like to have uh, like, a re like a reception. Uh, I would like to have a reception, something nice. With somebody. Uh, Chad is not a Catholic, so we wouldn't be married in the Catholic Church. That is Protestant. So, uh, you know, maybe it's maybe. It's getting crowded in here, guys. I'm going to wrap this one up. Huh? You could get, you could have a marriage here at Jimmy. Yeah, like that, something like that. But we're already married, it's just, a, it's just to go through the proceedings, right? Well, you could, show. Yeah. you could do one of your own. Your, your vows and stuff at that time. Right. Uh, yeah. 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 Now, now the pressure's on, you've got to start writing those vows. Yeah. <laughs> It's getting noisy in here, guys. I'm going to wrap this one up. Again, congratulations Thank to you, you both. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And good luck. And thank you, everyone. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe.